welcome back to the DK Goddess Palace. I will be doing Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Mars, Mercury, Venus, baby. We're gonna see what's going on. I wanna thank all my returning subscribers, everyone that has been learning, living, evolving with me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Take all the messages. Um, Take what you need and leave the rest. Not all the messages are going to be for you, Aquarius. Okay. So let's see what's going on. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm asking Mother, Father, Holy Spirit for. Thank you for allowing me to read the messages. I can't believe it's so fast. 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 Thank you. Thank you. So let's see what's going on. For mid-January, mid-January 2023, so this will be the 15th until the end of the end of January, okay? The end of the month. Alright, so let's see what's going on, Aquarius. Aquarius collectively now until the end of the month. For January 2023, what are the messages for Aquarius? woman i feel like there's things that you guys are it's like you guys are going back um you guys are going back trying to figure out what you want to do okay to a labor in reverse it's something that's not working like you're redoing something re uh revamping revamping a business redoing something here i definitely get like very soon something's going to be happening with your work thief and official person so i'm getting an energy where either somebody tried to take from you or you tried to take from somebody okay this can be you trying to take from somebody that's an official person here but i'm getting something's not working so aquarius take the messages the way that you need to either you're taking something from somebody else or someone's trying to take something from you or this is like the magic okay gifts is in reverse so yeah somebody's magic isn't working masculine wealthy men lovers expectation so somebody's expectation okay so i'm i'm getting aquarius i'm not sure if this is your your energy as in like this is what you want for someone or someone wants this for you but you take it how you need it i'm just getting an energy where someone definitely um is trying to steal or take from somebody someone's expectation is that somebody was going to be like down and out or someone was going to be like without is what i'm hearing but that's not what it's going to be okay i'm also getting aquarius um if this is you this is you like page of swords exactly coming up with some type of idea right but this is you pushing forward a lot of you guys can be stu studying reading something you see how she's reading a book okay but starting something over starting something from scratch with this light bulb like i said you're learning something some of you guys this may be like not rushing into something like someone you or someone else can be saying that they don't want to rush into a relationship or rush into something this can be you taking your time but i'm also getting this is like a revelation or aha moment birds communication so you may be receiving some type of communication or divine downloads here um yeah strength okay so the bottom of the next is six is six of swords 
So I feel like it's like you guys have been repeating a cycle. Or there's, some, there's something that you're repeating. Like you're trying to move forward here, but it's like you're still letting, you're still holding on to the past or you haven't walked away from the past fully. Nine of Cups. It's like you're really trying to be emotionally fulfilled here. But it's like, yeah. Some of you guys, this is really saying like you know that you need to walk away from something, from someone. It's like in order to move forward, you need to have some like approach king of swords or this is someone cutting you off the hair plan it's like someone's guided to cut something off someone off a habit a ideology a partnership where this is someone cutting you off here okay you could be having the strength it's like you're having the strength to move forward here or it's like you're trying to listen to your emotions because you're realizing like you need to it's like you're realizing that you need to stabilize yourself or this is like healing the star is like you need to heal because the nine of pentacles the verse is the two of swords is like someone making a decision to heal or this is like someone realizing that their wishes are coming true here the star but this is like balance i'm also getting healing when it comes to like your emotions so there can be things scorpio cancer pisces aquarius leo okay libra it's like things that you may have been spending your time your energy on here nine of pentacles in reverse something's not eight of wands so you could be receiving communication here when it comes to your time energy and effort or this is like you feeling like you're not getting all your wish or some type of wish or something because it's like pentacles is time energy and effort so you may have put 90 to 900 9000 hours money okay into something or it's like you're trying to see when when a return is going to come but it's like you need to make a the right decision you need to make the right decision because the eight of swords nine of swords and then judgment is in reverse this can be some like look the three of cups this is giving me like some of you guys are wanting to apologize or reconcile like after being caught about lying the hair font towards libra energy yeah i'm also getting your your faith in spiritual judgment the emperor or the empress energy you could be feeling stuck in a situation okay like you could be feeling very burdened or you it's like you're restless i'm also saying this could be magic this is like spell work candle work it's like something that you were doing is like returning or something Three of Cups, it's like a reconciliation, but judgment is reverse is a lie. So I feel like someone's lying about either a reconciliation or some type of friendship or partnership here. This is either you or someone else. Okay, the hair font and the emperor. I'm also getting it's like someone's already on their emperor, their emperor shit. Somebody's already a magician. Yeah. So it's, it's giving me the energy of like somebody's getting stuck or caught up in their own web. Like somebody tried to somebody tried to pull a wool over somebody's eyes or somebody was trying to fake like they were the emperor, the empress, or, or it's like somebody was trying to manipulate the magician. Yeah, ten of swords. It's like somebody knew that they were going going towards the ending, but it's like somebody was trying to attach themselves to your money, to your energy, or this is you. So you were doing this to somebody or somebody was doing this to you. Ten of swords. Ace of Swords. It's like it's like someone's trying to run off with somebody's ideas or thoughts here. This can also be you being in deep thought. I'm also getting this can be like somebody that was into the somebody either you're into the occult or somebody else's, but this is someone that's doing spell work, candle work here, or trying to um manifest, bring something in. Knight of Swords, but it's like you need to have like a stable footing. Three of Swords. So for some of you guys, it's like a loss here. Six of Pentacles, the Moon card, yeah. So I feel like you're trying to give. It's like you're trying to apologize. It's like you're trying to apologize. Someone's trying. Yeah, someone's trying. Okay, Ten of Cups, Ace of Cups is in reverse. Seven of Swords and Five of Wands. This, so this is like conflict. This is like conflict. Okay, this is someone trying to get you out of character. Okay, someone upset because. It's like an offer, whether it's like a family dynamic, mother, father, child, or it's like coming together or something. It's like you don't want to deal with it or you see something weird, okay? But I'm also getting this can also be conflict, chaos. Like some, like some, It's like conflict and chaos can be happening in your life because of either gossip or because of something that you were doing with like family or this is like chaos, confusion, illusions, okay? But I'm also getting this is what... 
it's something like this energy is around you guys eight of pentacles this may have to do with based off of your work or your time your energy it's like someone tries to okay I'm also I'm also getting the energy of like someone trying to take the eight of pentacles and the seven of swords it's like someone's trying to be deceptive okay so either you're trying to deceive somebody at work or this is like a group of people a coven a cult but i'm also getting eight of pentacles it's like something that you were doing for eight moon cycles or it's like this is like a plot plan a scheme yeah death is in reverse so something's not changing ace of wands the tower ten of swords so I feel like Aquarius, you're about to go through some type of ending. You're going through some type of shift, a major shift in your mind, okay? Or it's like you're having to be patient. You're having to wait something out with the tower. It's like you're going through a major transformation because you have to end a whole bunch of shit. It's like you have to... So I'm getting an energy of like if you're gossiping, doing magic, black magic or anything like that, page of swords, this is like um reading up on, right? Because it, it was giving me the energy of like somebody's plot, like somebody either... Like, you and a group of people or you and someone else was plotting to try and take because the tower is, like, trying to break down somebody's foundation, okay? Or this is happening to you. But the Eight of Swords, it gives me, like, you're doing it because you're the air sign. So, it's like, you're involved some way, somehow, whether it's texting, calling, whether you gossip, lie, spread rumor, or whatever the case is. It's like, whatever you were doing is the reason why something is stagnant or something's not going, okay? Because I feel like... The end result for you was to try to manipulate something to either take something or the group to take something or like it's three of cups. You know what I'm trying to say? So it's like three is a company. It's like three is too many. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Six of pentacles. So there was supposed to be like a 50-50 or something, but I feel like somebody was being greedy. It was either you or this could be a Leo, Capricorn, Rigor, Taurus. Yeah, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces in your energy. Someone's definitely emotionally mature. Like it's like some... Like, whatever I'm talking about, Aquarius, either someone's not, not going to be talking to you, or it's like, you're going to be trying to figure something out, is what I'm hearing. This can also be, if you're in school, if you're in school, if you're learning something, right, this can just be you, like, studying, you're, you're like, trying to focus on... You're trying to focus on um, what's in front of you. You know what I'm trying to say? Like, you're trying to focus on studying or learning or mastering something. But I'm also getting the energy. I keep getting, like, a master, uh, like, somebody that, somebody that was, somebody that tried to pull strings to manipulate somebody's life or destiny or fate. Or somebody that just started, like, somebody not, not just starting spirituality, but somebody that just started Starting learning something, you know what I'm trying to say? Like they're reading up on something on Google or something like that. So I don't know if this is you or somebody, else, but I just keep getting the energy of somebody doing spell work, candle work, okay? Or somebody manipulates something in a COVID cult group or gossiping or saying your name or this is like what you're doing. Like I don't know why because it keeps getting like the swords energy. So it's like whatever you're involved in is going to be like it's going to backfire because like something's not going to work in your favor. Yeah, it's like something's not going to work in your favor. Somebody's going to be. Somebody's going to be happy, balanced, okay? And somebody else is going to be, like, fucked up. Seven of Swords. It's like someone's trying to deceive somebody that's already, like, that already sees. This can be, like, a fake love situation or a fake love situation, like, partnership, family, dynamic. Yeah, somebody's going to be regret and remorse. Like, you could be sitting in regret and remorse. The road is in reverse. Yeah, somebody's world is turning upside down based off of what they were doing. So, I really feel like with the swords in reverse, it's like you guys are, <clears throat> a lot of you guys are really learning, like, you need to stop doing something or it's like in order for you to get a move on when it comes to your time, money, effort, energy, whatever, it's like you have to do something different. You have to be, um, you have to break free from some type of hold because this is really giving me, like, gossip, like, thoughts, communication, ideas. Like, it's like having to change or reconstruct that, reprogram that, okay? If this is gossip, rumors, or whatever it is, it's like return. It, I just get, like, a backfire. Like, if you were doing this, this is why shit is going on in your life the way it is, okay? I feel like if you're doing this behind somebody's back who's actually a, ma who's a magician or who's... uh in your field of work, I should say, it's, like, something like that, like, somebody's trying to take from somebody else, like, thinking that they could get away with it, but it's not gonna work, okay, so I feel like, Aquarius, if this is you, 
some weird shit is about to be happening or some weird shit is going to be going on. But it's based off of, like, your actions, your choices, your decisions, what you've been speaking out, what you've been saying, what you've been trying to manifest, something like that. All right? Like, it's like something was manifested or something was trying to be brought in, like, with the wrong intent or it's, like, for the wrong reason. So maybe this is also you asking why you're doing something or the reason why you're doing something, okay? So, peace, love, and light, Ashe. I love you like I love you.